What's going on YouTube? This is Wayne with Wayne's Fish World and today I'm coming at you with a new build. We're building a 2.5 gallon dwarf seahorse aquarium. I've been putting this off and today we're going to be talking about backgrounds. What are the benefits of a background? Well guys, there's two main benefits. One is comfort and aesthetics is the second one. What I mean by comfort is when you have a background all around your aquarium or even just the back, I prefer three sides, it's going to provide comfort to the inhabitants of your aquarium. Now, aesthetics. Aesthetics is it's going to make your aquarium pop. You can go two routes about this. You can have a flat color or you can have a picture of a background or a 3D background. Now, what I don't like about those backgrounds provided you provided for you at Walmart, Petco or PetSmart or etc is that you're adding your aquascape to a picture of aquarium. You don't want to do that. You want to go and get a solid color or a 3D background and make that complement your aquascape. You're not trying to add on to aquascape provided it, you want to have a color or a 3D background supplement and complement your own aquarium aquascape. Now, plastic dip versus spray paint. Anybody that's ever used spray paint and decided to take that background off, you can use ammonia, Windex, or whatever it might be, some kind of solution. You guys know that when you're scraping that thing off, it's extremely hard to get off. It takes several you know, it could take hours all depending on the size of your aquarium. With Plastic Dip, it's a rubber coating. Once it's completely dry and cure, you can scrape this off very easily. You take one little piece and you can peel the entire Plastic Dip right off like, um, like, uh, plastic wrap pretty much. Exactly the same concept. Now, there's many different colors in Plastic Dip. It's completely safe for the aquarium. I would not put it inside the aquarium but outside the aquarium it's completely safe um there's the same concept behind spray paint except the fact that if you want to remove it plastic dip is going to be completely easier to remove now i'm using the color blue blaze and you can see the background on this aquarium absolutely popped i mean absolutely popped if i was going to use some kind of spray paint which i'll never use again unless it's inside the aquarium i would completely go with krylon fusion spray paint you can use acrylic latex whatever you want but spraying it is completely easy now one disadvantage for spray uh plastic dip it is higher the plastic dip blue bl blue blaze ran me about almost ten dollars eight ninety nine and you guys can see i'm actually removing the deep blue sticker on this tank it took me a year to do that on my 55 gallon this is way with wayne's fish world i'll see you guys next time comment rate and subscribe later